Can you speak to any challenges or any things that Lemonly had overcome? Yeah, definitely. Um, I think uh, certainly that Marriott year when we, you know, we had a huge reduction in well, our largest client and were able to not have to like lay anybody off was a challenging year. I think that's probably in the second half of Lemonly where I gained a more appreciation appreciation for leadership um, and the, the burden that an entrepreneur carries. Because when you get off that phone call internally inside a room by yourself, a lot of thoughts are running through your head of, can I pay these people? Um, are we going to make it? Will we survive? Did I just turn something that was valuable into something that's no longer valuable? Um, you know, you always kind of go to bed where thinking the whole thing's just going to fall yeah, apart. Absolutely. <laughs> and I think that's pretty common for entrepreneurs. Um, but then you step out of the building or out of that room and everyone's working and just doing their job and, and doing what they're, what you're asking them to do. And you kind of got to just show up and be there for them and be the person that they need you to be. Right. 